All right. Welcome to the um the live stream, and I will be showing you how to make this livery. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. So, let's go ahead and go down to Tools, Livery Editor, AC4400. Now, let's go ahead and create new. C and 2. Let's go ahead and get started after I get everything loaded up. Hold on. Alright. Let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing you want to do is go ahead and make the engine black. Alright, just like that. It's going to go ahead and add to layers, shapes. Now you, as per usual, you want to use a square. That's like my favorite. So you just want to go ahead and make it sideways like that. Don't want to change color. Um, what's the button? I haven't played this in a hot minute because it's just been crashing. That's why I haven't been able to uh, play the game in a little bit. Um, slightly annoying. Just want it just like that, and I don't want that white line up to the cab because it's not like that in the real locomotive. So, just gonna hit copy that and place it right about there. All right, there we go. And let's go ahead and get the red down. So let's go ahead and get the shape that we want. Once I find it. Now basically the entire cab is um, red. Now we do want to kind of make it a little bit hazy, so you want to use this, alright? So let's make it all the way around, just like so. Now you just want to make it right about there. Make sure it, it cut, not like that, because we don't want that. All the way about to there. But, yeah, I'm just showing you guys. I'm not actually going to do it because it's really annoying. Alright, and we don't want that. Just going to head to delete that. So that's not in the way later on. Now, as per usual, just get a square. Now 
Now I just want to do that. Then change color to bright red like that. And you can already see the Canadian National livery popping out quite nicely. Now let's go ahead and line it up like so. Just like that. Oh, that's. forgot to copy it there. Alright, that's gonna look more like FXE than anything. Um, yeah. Now, uh, since this game is a little bit glitchy at the moment, and I'm sure whenever they do update it, it's gonna be, uh, probably when the dash 8 comes out, which is hopefully soon. Yeah. Now, you just wanna go ahead and make that sideways and put it right about there. Uh, hold on. Well, actually, that line needs, that white line needs to be further back. So probably right about there. about right. So right about there, you want to go ahead and place that. Copy. Make sure it's even. Now, this is probably one of the easier look motives to do. Due to just the complete simplicity of it. Oh, we're making that smaller. I see. The only thing that is moderately difficult about this paint scheme is, um... Oh, what am I doing? I'm just being a big chalupa. Alright, there we go. Let's delete that. Um, hold on, I'll read your comment in a second. Once I get YouTube channel pulled up here. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yeah. Alright, um... Alright, so as you guys can see, go ahead and got that. So let's copy that. Bring it right around to the other side. Just like that. Alright, seriously, which one is covering the freaking nose? Okay, so we need to get rid of that one. There we go. Just like so, just like that. Make it on both sides, not like that though. Yes, I will do BNSF. Uh, I I like to practice before I actually make uh, the um, locomotives themselves. All right, and that's still freaking glitchy. That's just great, isn't it? So basically, as soon as it touches the top of the locomotive, then it tends to screw up. Um, yeah. Let's just be really, really careful here. And I am going to do the war bonnet. 
Uh, that one's probably going to be one of the more difficult ones. But I will most certainly try. Um, and Union Pacific, I have made, I'm working on the, um, um, whatchamacallit, the Norfolk Southern right now. That one is proved to be the most problematic out of them all. Uh, probably relatively soon, so probably about, like, maybe a, a week or so. Um... But yeah, I have no idea. Depends on how long I have because the school has just now started up and all that stuff. So that's going to be intensely difficult. And hello, uh, Washington area or Washington D.C. area rail fan. Um, Yes, I can attempt to do that. Uh, do mark. Yeah, I... I think I've been scoping that one out. I, I've just been thinking about it for a little while. So, yeah, you guys can already see how the CN colors just come together pretty easily. Now here comes the pretty difficult part. Which is going to be... Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh... Hello, uh, Trains of America. I completely forgot. You're like the first one who joined and I didn't hear my chat up. Yeah, hello. Alright, anyways, this is probably going to be the most tricky part. Um, no, not text. So, you probably just want to go ahead and get, you know, a square as per usual. No, that's not a square. That's a faded square. It's just going to be slightly annoying. Oh, no, not this again. I sure hope they did fix that. Because that is going to be extraordinarily... Thank you. I appreciate that, considering I only have, what, 70-some uh, subscribers. Um... The one who came on of park mark P eight seventy nine. Oh, that's pretty cool. Right, so, oh no, I got my freaking screwed up controller. I always get my screwed up controller and it just like drifts. And it's just super annoying. Alright. Let's go ahead and hopefully... Nope, that still hasn't fixed it yet. Is it rounded on the corners? Hold on. Uh, don't type anything in the chat yet. Um, images. Alright, yeah, it is rounded. So we don't want that. We probably want something more of this... Let me get back to YouTube real quick. For some reason, I don't get to notice that you. Yeah, sometimes YouTube like decides to be like uh, chalupas. Uh, right, what am I doing here? I'm being a big chalupa right now. I just. All right, we don't use that one now. I really don't know why it does these stupid stars. It's god annoying. Yes, we're live right now. Oh, cool. Well, I, I think I'm gonna do, um, CP, like, oh no, I got my list right here. So, right now we're doing CN, next one is UP, next one is NS, next one will be Wheeling and Lake Erie, 
next one will be C, CP, next one's FXE, and there might be a few, a few more in there that I've missed. This is a list from like maybe a week ago, maybe. Um, all right, yeah, I will definitely check you out once I'm finished with the stream real quick. And I recommend whoever else is watching this, um, go check out uh, the, uh, the upload rail cam. Alright, you guys need to go check that out, it's pretty cool, even though I haven't seen it myself. Alright, anyways. Yes, that's what FXE is for a mix. Which I still yet to catch in real life, there's uh, FXE on, um... G89, maybe in January, last January, but of course it goes through at like midnight, and I'm not going out that late because uh, if you guys haven't seen a few of my videos, there's like a guy who cusses himself out a whole bunch, and I'm not trying to stay there and find out. But you know, sorry. Right. Alright, there we go. That looks good. Copy. that one a little bit longer <clears throat> yeah, there we go Not copy anymore. There we go. Make that one a little bit longer. Where'd it angle right there? Just delete that one because that one looks quite goofy. And you guys can modify this as well to like y'all st st specs. Because I know I'm dang well that I'm not doing the best at this. Uh, we probably picked the wrong one, copy right there. No, we don't want to copy that one. Um, if you look at my channel, I have your chest. Oh, that's pretty cool. Thank you. Uh. I wasn't paying attention. I just, all right, whatever. I think I meant to delete that one. That's all right. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. Uh, delete. I think this one's going to be deleted too. not mean to do that. There we go. That, you know, that's just gonna be, that's just gonna have to be for tonight. Alright. 
Yes, I, I was expecting you to show up because you've been asking me for a while to do this or to um just like get a video out. I I'm assuming you didn't really care. Oh, that's how you do it. All right. I think this is most messages that uh, I've ever had in a live stream for a while. I think ever. Let's make it a little bit bigger. Now, I am thinking about doing this. Um. Um. What should I call it? Uh, the zebra for the CN. So let's do that. Yeah, I think uh, the update did glitch a few things out. Alright. Oh, okay. So we just gonna hit. Alright, let's not do that one for the back. Yeah, the glitch. Well, at least they did take the glitch out where, um,. If you like hover over like a certain one, um, it, like whenever you're scrolling through, you guys know what I'm talking about. It just puts down whatever. Yeah, I think they got rid of that, thankfully. Right, let's make that a little bit smaller right there. There we go. Hold on, let me go ahead and get a picture up just in case. Uh, blip, blop. Alright, yeah, that looks pretty good. Oh, yeah, that's right, we need the red number. That is quite important. Let's go ahead. Alright, can you like work? I don't think it wants to group. Um, nice. Uh, do you also do you know where um, the Jeep Thirty Nine is? That is in Martinsburg, or well, because it's missing, and I it hasn't came back for like a solid month. Uh, I'm assuming it's down at Brunswick or something. Are you having trouble getting it? Uh, yeah, but I usually put it in the, um, the Jeep 38. Well, hold on, let me finish Trains of America's question, or question to me. Um, I usually put it in Nachi and then just hold the sand for, like, until I get up to five miles an hour. Um... Yeah, that's usually what I do. Uh, alright, next question. The Jeep 30, um, I believe it is a Jeep 39, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, oh. Well, what are they, I wonder what they're doing to it down there. Uh, I have no idea what they would be doing to it down there, but yeah. it's just slightly annoying. So the red number that we are going to, do, well, I've just been waiting for it to come back for like forever because I'd go down and like every single day and hope that it's just leading a mark train. Uh, well, the work shouldn't be that, um, like long alright 88 alright what am I doing no we don't want alright let's just go ahead 8108 um I don't believe I am familiar with that red number is that one of the, um, the, the pony, like, 
the pony hair on the back. Hold on, let me look this up real quick. 4008. Nope, that's not what I want. I don't want a Persia. And S. Here we go. Huh, that is an interesting looking one. Um. I have no idea. Maybe it would be... Huh. Recently rebuilt GE ACU 4400... Or ACU 44 C6M 4008 suffered an engine fire tonight near... This is uh, a while ago, by the way. Uh, former Dash 8... Dash 9 has been retired, and... Okay. Interesting. Huh, that's pretty cool. Oh, I should probably... Uh, my controller must fell, that would have been tragic. Um, yeah. And do you know where, uh, Q138 is? Or how late it is going, anyone? Because it's just been, like, I see a clear signal for it, but they must be lighting it up at, um, at a Cumberland. It's just slightly annoying. I'm just gonna group all these together real quick. Put them onto the other side. And unfortunately, it's not as long as a video as I'd like it to. Um, but yeah, that should be about it. Um, so, no. Save it. I know it looks kind of goofy. The original copy looks better. Um,. Gonna hit save changes. Yeah, it may be still be in Cumberland, still that happens to me. It was supposed to come but it did not. Yes, I can do Conrail. Um I might be able to do Conrail tonight actually. So yeah, um Alright, just for example uh oh. Alright, well, um. Alright, there's, there's that one. So, oh wait, no, that was the original copy. I'm s That's just slightly annoying. Alright, um. Hold on. So let's just go ahead and show you guys the original copy of it. Uh, Alright, yes, I do have UP. Yes. Alright, um, so here's the original CN. 8400. And here's CN number 2. <laughs> that looked... Alright, uh, the logos definitely need to be, um... I'm pretty, yes, uh, Mark trains have been coming prettier. Yes, considering, uh, whenever I was getting off work today, the Mark train was already in its, the first, uh, Mark train was already in its, uh, spot at Martinsburg at 4.45 today. Here's Kansas City Southern, just in case anyone else isn't watching, or in the stream. Um... And this is the Union Pacific that I've been, like, sketching up on. It doesn't look too bad. But this one's a whole lot more difficult to make. So. Alright. 
I have a Jeep 38 skin. Uh, I do have a Seaboard, and I'm not OP. Yeah, that's what it is. See. Oh boy, what did I just do? Ah, oh, that's the door. Alright, um, let's go ahead and get right up on the Conrail units. Hmm. Well, actually, I'm going to go ahead and do the, um, like, show off the, uh, Canadian National that we've just made. And then I'll end the stream, and then I will go ahead and, uh, and go ahead and do the, the Conrail. So I have two different streams, which will probably make it a little bit more convenient. Imagine if you could you could live redesign the MP3. Yes, I wish they would add that, but I've been watching a few of their streams, at or dovetail streams and like the developer developers and whatnot, and they said that they're not going to do that. They will only do that to the sand patch, the um, the ice train. 